Welcome to the ATE TV Build Your Own Video Website. Today we're going to talk about music, audio, and sound effects, and how you can use those to enhance the look and feel of your video. All right, let's get started, all right? We'll go up to Video Manager, and we're going to go down to the left here to this side menu and go to Create. Click on Create, and it automatically defaults to Audio Library, which is exactly where we want to be. Right. This gives us a whole list of songs for free, and again, you can use all this music in your video. If we scroll down, look at all these options. Whoa, all right. Let's listen to this first song, Sunday Plans. <laughs> That's the first one. It's not bad, actually. Up here we have tracks, favorites, genres, mood, instrument, duration, attribution. And you can also search for different types of music. If you see this little icon here, Creative Commons Attribution, that means if you use this piece of music, you have to give credit to the artist. As it says, you're free to use this song in any of your videos, but you must include the following in your video description. So you just have to put that in there if you're going to use one of these songs with the icon on it. If it doesn't have that icon, like Sunday Plans, you're free to use this song in any of your videos. So you don't have to do anything else. If you find a song you like, you can star it, and that will add it to your favorites. I found one song and I put it in my favorites called Tuned In. Take a listen. It's kind of fun and funky, hip hop and rap, slash dark. If you look up here, we can pick between different genres in the drop down menu. Now there's ambient. Children's, classical, hip hop and rap, uh, reggae and rock. I have all kinds of different options. I can also pick the mood of my music angry, bright, dark, happy. Or there's the instrument. You know, you can pick a piano song or acoustic guitar. And duration is pretty obvious. And attribution. This is a good way to drill down and find the music that will really fit your piece. All right. And you see these lines here. That's the popularity of the song. So that's how many times it's been used, really. If you want something that's been used a lot, that's fine. But maybe you want something a little more unique. You can also download these songs to your computer by clicking on the download buttons to the right. Now let's go over to sound effects. All right, we click over to the sound effects tab, and here we have all kinds of sound effects that you can choose from for free, and which is awesome, right? So if you need an alarm clock, let's listen to this. Wow, wake up! That's annoying. All right, let's go down a little bit and uh, check out something else. Maybe ambulance siren. This is all alphabetical, and you can also search in the search window up to the right. Now that we know the audio library a little bit, let's go to the video editor and start adding some of these uh, tracks of music into our project. All right. We started this project called Demo Audio and Music, and let's take a let's stretch this out just a little bit so we can see some of our clips, get a sense of what's in the timeline. All right. Let's take a listen here. My name is Vittorio Pascal. I'm here second year. That was our first shot. And we're going to go up here to audio. Now, I felt like he was a little bit low. So what I want to do is I'm going to click on audio. And I am going to bring the volume up just a little bit. My name is Vittorio Pascal. I'm here second year. That sounds better. I can do a few other things here. I can pan from right to left speaker. I can change the bass. I can bring it up or down. I can bring the treble up and down. 
I'm not going to really mess with those too much. I just want to play with the volume and make sure that the volume sounds good. All right, let's put some music in. I'm going to click on my music track down here. My name is Vittorio Pascal. And then I'm going to go up here. If you see these different icons, that, that uh, musical note is the one that I want. That makes sense, right? All right, and it gives me my music library. But I want to find my favorite song. So I am going to search by this title, Tune In. And of course, there are all kinds of tune in songs. Um, but I remember mine was by R.W. Smith, and it was hip hop and rap. So I'm going to go and search through that. And here it is. All right, not too far down. And to add it in, I just click on the plus button. So simple, right? My name is Vittorio Pascal. I'm here second year, planning to become a civil engineer. Post high school, I attended a liberal arts school for a year and afterwards worked at a salesman. All right, I like the music, but I feel like the music and his talking are competing with each other. So I want to bring that, that volume down. All right, so let's bring that down to a little bit under 50% and see where that takes us. My name is Vittorio Pascal. I'm here second year, planning to become a civil engineer. Post high school, I attended a liberal arts school for a year and afterwards worked. I still feel it's like a little bit too loud, still competing with his voice. You know, this is not an exact science. You're going to have to play around and, and get it to a place where you want to be able to hear it, but you don't want it so loud where it's competing with his voice. So let's bring it down to about 25%. My name is Vittorio Pascal. I'm here second year, planning to become a civil engineer. Post high school, I attended. That sounds good. Let's check in a couple of different places along the way just to make sure. It's definitely hands on and also theory. You know how water in a tube tries to find its own level? That seems fine. And let's go towards the end a little bit here and check it one more time. A lot of interaction between students. You might find yourself asking a pair a question as to how to better. You wouldn't really want the music much louder than this. I think it's just about perfect. All right. Now, if you notice over here that the music goes further than the video, so I want to trim that music up and end it right when the video ends. And I'm wanting to become an engineer. It's not easy, but it's definitely a challenge. Oh, wow. Ended at a good place, right on a beat, little fade off. It doesn't happen too often that way. Sometimes you really have to adjust that and and move it back and forth a little bit to get it to where you need it to be. All right, I want to create this video and call it a day. Create video. Click. Thanks for joining us. See you next time.